Hi. Um, this is a book printed in 1968. As I've said before, military books printed in the 60s and 70s, most of them only have a novelty value now because they've been hopelessly outdated. However, this one by Little John and Dodkins, which is Orders, Decorations, Medals and Badges of the Third Reich, including the Free City of Danzig, published 1968. To this day, it still remains a good book. It's well worth searching out. It has the common Iron Cross, the War Medic Medal, the War Medic Cross, the West War Medal, everything that you associate with being a German medal, it's in here. Um, second hand nowadays, you can buy these for between nine and 15 pound. If you collect World War II German medals, buy yourself a copy. It is really good value for money. When it was printed in 1968, it was only intended to be a single volume. There's no volume one on it. However, so successful it was that the publishers, Little John Dudkins, decided to do a volume two. However, what they picked for the volume two wasn't very successful. So that's fairly commonly found, 9 to 15 pound. This one, printed in 1973, is Orders, decorations, medals and badges of the Third Reich. Now says volume two. And you look for volume one and you can't find volume one because volume one doesn't have volume one on it because it was only intended to be a one-off book. Volume two is awards of the German Volksgruppen outside the Reich, the pro-Nazi parties of occupied Western Europe and also the puppet states of Croatia and Slovakia. Basically, it's the awards that you're never going to encounter as a collector. Um, it only runs, volume 1 runs to 200 and something pages, this one only runs to 190 pages. It also contains a huge stack of mistakes which was in the volume 1, it's been put right in the volume 2. Line drawings, photographs, as it went to publication in 1973, Dodkins died in 74. Now it mentions in the book that we don't do the French awards, they do the Dutch ones, they do all the other countries that was occupied by the Germans and the Germans produced awards for that country but they don't do the Vichy French ones because they say that the Vichy French ones belong purely to France and they only deal with awards from the countries that Germany occupied but no Vichy French ones. Now I personally think the reason why they omitted Vichy French ones was because when this went to publication in 73-74 Britain had just entered the EEC with France so maybe they omitted the Vichy French ones because they didn't want to upset the French and um, but anyway we'll put them on the chair we'll have a look at them this one I got two days ago on eBay cost me 20 pound I bought it was a buy now so I thought I've not had that one before I'll buy it it makes up the set and um, this one wasn't a great commercial success very rarely do you find it I was very lucky to find it for what I paid for it Again, it's a good reading thing, but I'll never find the awards that are in it. But it makes a good companion volume for the volume one. So we'll, ha we'll have a go through them and see what, what's in them. Um, I paid 20 quid for this. I don't know what it goes for second hand, because I've not seen one second hand. This is the only one I've seen. So 20 quid, I consider to be a fair price to pay for it. Um, but buy that one before you buy that one. Because that one, the volume one, has the... The more common awards in that you're going to find. So we'll put them on the chair and we'll have a look through them and see what's what. Just bear with me a second. Right. Now, <clears throat> volume one, this is how you will find them. White board covers, just like that. The first 500 copies, of which this isn't one of them, the first 500 copies are they have a little tiny where's that there they have a little box the first 500 copies are numbered within that box this isn't one of those so if you can get one that's numbered so much the better it contains most of what you associate with being german world war ii awards order of the german eagle fire brigade decoration long service awards non-portable awards Nazi Party Awards, Party District Badges, Sports Badges, 
youth badges, Spanish Civil War awards, orders, decorations, and medals. Thirty nine forty five. All of one of clasps, cuff titles, shields. It is a very well informative book for when it was published. As I say, nineteen sixty eight was the publication date of this book, and it contains a wealth of information for the time. So even though it was printed way back in 68, it still warrants a place today among your collector's books. And you shouldn't have any trouble finding this volume one. And it's basically this sort of format right throughout. The awards they couldn't get, they've, they've made line drawings of them. It's very, very informative. As I say, I bought this one second hand for £9 off eBay. Goblets. It is a minefield of information. Some good illustrations. It, it does the job. Cuff titles. So it's well worth adding it. To your collector bookshelf quite a lot of good stuff in there and it does say where we are somewhere around 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 it says that the authors are British which tallies over in the second volume because it says in the second volume that Where are we at? France is however excluded since it was a truly sovereign state and the awards instituted during the Vichy regime belong very definitely to the French and not to Nazi history. So there you are. But again, as I say, 1974 was a publication date of Volume 2 and I think they omitted it because Britain had just gone into the EEC with France. And again, it's got loads of stuff like you're not going to see. You're not going to encounter most of the stuff that's in here Norwegian badges Slovakian badges it says there Colonel Dodkins died 1974 it follows the same format Awards that, although they are German, you're probably not going to encounter them. They probably weren't awarded in any great quantity. Probably very difficult to get your hands on them today. But because I've got that one, that's the one worth searching out. I had to buy this one because I saw it the other day on eBay and I thought. It will make a really nice set, which it does. As I say, this second volume printed 1974. And about, about that much of the book is mistakes from the volume one. So that's the two volumes, orders, decorations, medals and badges of the Third Reich, that one 1968, by the time 1973 came around, volume two, which is, buy that one, if you see it available in this cheap, buy it, don't go out of your way to get it, but if you didn't do World War II German medals and you haven't got that, well worth investing nine to 15 pound, you won't regret it. So that's the two volumes. So, bye for now.